I wanted to see if it was possible to get 6,000 trophies in one day. We all know this game is pay to win, but I needed an excuse to spend my money. So I made it sure, and I said for every subscriber I got from it, I was gonna spend 5 pennies. And we ended up getting 10,000 subscribers from this one show. That is equivalent to 500 pounds, which is equivalent to $626 in America, which is equivalent to 75,000 hog riders. So let's see if we can go from 0 to 6,000 trophies using 500 pounds and prove this game is pay to win. Brand new Clash Royale account. We have to spend 500 pounds on this account. Just to let you know, I'm not Mr. Beast. That is an insane amount of money for me. Everyone make a prayer for my bank account. Anyways, we then created this name. Audrey's? Oh, oh. Pay to win game. And as soon as I came out from training camp, I instantly bought a special offer. And we just passed training camp, Arena 1. You unlock wizard in Arena 4. But guess what? We can buy in the shop already for two pounds and get some gems. After redeeming the offer, we then spent 100 pounds already. 100 pounds just like that spent. Insane. I did this so we can buy lots of chests for the first few arenas and upgrade my cards a lot. We haven't even started pushing and my deck is already over leveled as hell. We then bought the diamond pass royale. And now we're getting the pass royale. After spending more money in one sitting than girls at a shopping mall, we finally started pushing with our overleveled unfair deck. Let's give good old Riley a head start. I'm gonna let him take my tower down. Okay, now we gotta defend this properly. Hold on a minute. Goblin cage. And now we're gonna three crown him. Epic comeback. That knight just got shredded. The minion placement, what's he doing? Look at the brawler! Dude, his tower got smashed! Arena 2! Two special offers! So of course, Daddy bought both of them! Oh, 40 Valkyries! 400 Archers! We then bought more lightning chests with the gems from earlier and upgraded our cards even more. We have a level 8 deck in Arena 2! So, as you'd expect, we passed Arena 2 quicker than the plane that crashed in 9 11. His arrows did not kill my archers, bro. GG. Arena 3! We then bought another special offer. Oh, yes. Look at all of this. And gems. And then, of course, we bought more chests and upgraded more cards. It is true what they say, money buys you happiness. Being so overleveled allowed us to pass Arena 3 so quickly. Oh, that fireball. Oh, that fireball. Ah! Wizard. Level 3 wizard. He puts a bomb, but they just got eliminated. Look at that. That's tower. Come on. Boom. Arena 4. I then, of course, bought another offer. And another special offer. Look at all of this. And as usual, we bought more lightning chests as I still had so many gems left and I upgraded more cards. And level 9 night. Bro, our deck, this is crazy. The push to Arena 5 was obviously easy. Split lane push, split lane push. Like that, he can't just defend everything with a wizard. He defends my other lane. But now look at this lane. Look at this lane, the archers, bang. Finish him, and boom. Arena 5, here we come. Hey, We already know what we're buying here. This is one juicy offer. Look at all of this. And of course, we opened more chests, and then we made a replacement in the deck. Let's put Daddy Hog Rider in the deck. On my way to Arena 6, I 3 crowned everyone, just how I 3 crowned my steps. Hog Rider Knight. What a great wizard. What a great Inferno Tower. Hog Rider smashes him, GG. Since I'm over leveled, my fireball kills the wizard. Ah. Uh, now, Mini Pekka defend it. I think Mini Pekka should fully counter that. Mini Pekka? Mm. Hog Rider. <laughs> I think he gave up. He gave up. Bro, rage quit. <laughs> and Arena 6. And shortly after, we bought a special offer with overpowered cards. We just got Mummy Pekka and Mummy Witch. Oh, yes. 
And now my deck was gonna become unstoppable. Mummy pack instead of hog rider. Mummy witch instead of wizard. Baby dragon instead of minions. Skarmy instead of knight. And goblin baru instead of archers. And I then bought some king's chests so I can upgrade my epics. Ah, uh, let's buy this. Gold, wild cards, more wild cards. Wild cards, okay, wizards, mega minions, okay, epics, guards, okay. Arrows, that's great. Rockets, brah. Come on. Bah, yes! I love mommy Pekka. All right, one more, one more, one more. Now you get serious. Okay, big cards now. Oh, not fire spirit. Not goblins. Not tombstone. Okay, please. Please, mummy witch, mummy witch. Okay, more mummy peckers, I'll take that. And thanks to this, I was able to make my deck over leveled as hell. Level 10. This deck is actually broken. Pushing to arena seven was so easy. Easier than trying to get goals at the kids park. This guy's got a level seven mummy pecker. My level 10 mummy pecker gonna shred it. Wait, let's put Skarmy to distract. Oh. Mummy Pekka's going to distract everything. No. <laughs> Mini Pekka, get some juicy damage. Oh, yes. Blim Barrel. Okay. 2 HP. Perfect. Arena 7. We then bought another offer. I nine pounds on this offer. 400 Americans. A bunch of pork chops. Daddy Prince. And gems and gold, bro. And I then spent my remaining gems on a chest. We got 2,000 gems left. So you know what? Screw it. Let's go. Come on, wild cards. Royal recruits. Three musketeers unlocked. Rocket, dark prince. Minions. I'll take that. Giant. Okay. Baby dragons. That's good. All right. That's all right. And of course, I upgraded my cards. Let's go to Arena 8. It literally only took us 30 minutes to get to Arena 8 because of our over-leveled deck. Skarm in this position. We don't receive any damage. Perfect. Fireball mummy witch. Ah! Peck at the back. Seriously, a balloon. Can that witch die? Good. Look at this guy with a level 6 balloon. One more hit, that's it. Look at me with my level 11 pecker. Oh, he's finished. He's finished. Goblin barrel. Yeah, he's not defending this. Goblin, kill that bomber. The bomber doesn't even one-shot the goblin. The bomber didn't even watch shot the goblin. No, this guy's done. Bible, prediction, score me. And boom! Arena A! You know why I love this arena? Because it's icy, like my drip. We then spent more money on a pointless offer. Honestly, this offer is not worth it, but let's just buy it anyways. Oh my. We then spent another 100 pounds to get more gems. And here comes our second bucket of 14,000 gems. So I bought more chests, and then I changed my deck a little bit. Honestly, our deck is too expensive, so let's make it cheaper. So we officially spent half of our money already, but it was worth it, as Arena 8 was light work. So guys, we are one game away from unlocking the Monk, but we're also one game away from Jungle Arena, which is where the Monk belongs, because he's a Monk! Okay, okay. Alright, Goblin Barrel, protect all the fireball. I think we've got, we've gone too aggressive from the start. Oh, we protect it. Oh, let's go. Oh, no, I do not like this. I actually don't like this. Oh, no, 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 no. That fireball, that fireball, that fireball. Ice spirit, freeze the witch, freeze the witch. Okay, okay, okay. We survived. Let's go aggressive again. Come on. Okay, damage. That's good damage. That's some good damage. That's some good damage. He's emoting, look at him. I'm gonna cry the whole game. I'm gonna make him cry the whole game. Let's fireball that witch. Oh, look at him flexing his muscle. Me, 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 me. Me, 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 me. Me, 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 me. He's crying back. Let's dash tower. Me, 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 me. <laughs> Jungle Arena, Arena 9. Jungle Arena, Ooga Booga. We then got another special offer which I didn't even need, but I'm just doing it to spend money at this point. We got the jungle pack for 15 pounds. Bro, these offers are actually getting more expensive by the minute. And then we unlock this. <sighs> Monk! Oh! 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 Let's go! And we're gonna put him instead of skeleton army. Look. 
Freeze instead of arrows. And balloon instead of baby dragon. I then started redeeming all the chests from the past royale so I can upgrade my cards such as the monk. Another daddy, another monk, another monk. Level 12. I then redeemed all of the tokens from the past royale so I could buy wild cards. Look, we can buy all these wild cards. And I used this to make my deck even more over leveled. Sorry in advance for everyone, I'm about to clap. I hope they accepted my apology, because no one stand any chance against my monk and my overleveled cards. Monk now. What is he doing? Freeze? Oh, Larry's going to take my tower. It's fine, because we took his, I think. Yeah, yeah. Ah, right, let's recon him. Go, go. Monk ability now in case he puts like a snowball or something. Come on. Come on, we reflect the snowball. Okay, I think this should be GG. Come on, two more shots. Come on, otherwise I'm screwed. Come on, take that tower down because there's a big push and boom! Aye! The monk reflected that white sticky substance like a boss. And arena 10, here we go. I then bought this offer. 2,600 Teslas, 800 furnaces, 80 Expos. Wow. I then upgraded some cards and did this. We got a level 11 expo from that offer. So you know what? Let's just use it. The deck wasn't too bad and we got to arena 11 pretty quickly. Boosted balloon, let's go. This is an old trick. The baby dragon pushes the balloon faster. Oh, that wizard. How is the wizard shooting my balloon from there? Let's get an expo lock. Prediction. Expo lock. Wait, Monk. Perfect. No way, Monk just defended both of them. I'm gonna ignore. I'm gonna ignore the left tower. Balloon, Monk, hurry up! Come on, Monk, reflect the wizard. He just rocketed a 25 HP tower. Are you serious? Pekka, Pekka, defend that run rider. Pekka, defend that rock. Try get an expo lock, Monk. Okay, really bad, Monk. Monk ability in case he puts rocket. Oh, why did he put wizard? Why did he put wizard? One idiot. Oh, no! Ah! Another expo lock. Prediction. Predicted! Bro got read like a book. For the rocket, for the rocket, for the rocket. Okay, for the Valkyrie as well. Okay. Okay. Let's put a balloon there. Predict his rocket. Come on. Freeze, 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 freeze the Ram Rider. Freeze the Ram Rider. He puts a wizard. Freeze, freeze, freeze! Oh, that gave me a heart attack. That gave me a heart attack, bro. That Ram Rider. And boom! Arena 11! I then got some legendaries from the past, Royale. First legendary of the day, Mega Knight. Okay, my hardwood. Second legendary of the day, Mega Knight. Mega Knight. Oh, mummy princess. I love the Mega Knight. Please give me... Why are you giving me my hardwood? Come on, Mega Knight. Mega... Ha! I then proceeded to buy some legendary king's chests. Ah, oh, three musketeers. Mommy Becca. Mega Nut. Mega Nut. Mega Nut. Ah, my hard wood and the big black woman. Okay. Let's go again. Again. Let's take the battle healer. Let's take this. Okay. Another chance. Another chance. Mega Nut. Mega Nut. Mega Let's go. Let's go. And another monk. You get the point. We bought a bunch of these and we got so many cards and so many monks. And then we bought this special offer. Look at all these legendaries. Electro Daddy Wizard Miners. I love the miners. My hardwood. I like hitting my hardwood. On the princess who's on the rage as well. Big black woman. I love her. Inferno Dragon. I want him to inferno me. Megana with his two big black balls. And Mummy Sparky throwing her white stuff all over me as well. What a great offer. I added Mega Knight to the deck and we pushed to Arena 12 so quickly. I'm about to put the Mega Knight with his two big black balls on the big black woman. That woman ain't touching my tower. Oh, yes. Let's go with the uh, balloon. Let's go with the balloon. No, wait. That balloon is going to go in front. Oh, I'm done, bro. I quit. I quit. You know what? Let's put the monk ability. feel like it will reflect the musketeer still. Boom. Let's go pick out the back. Back on the back. Okay, we're gonna start this push now. We're gonna three crown him. I'm gonna ignore the Ram Rider. I'm gonna ignore the Ram Rider. I'm gonna ignore that. Monk, go in front. Perfect. Mega Knight. Mega Knight. Perfect. Reflect. P 
put the reflection ability on. We reflect the musketeer. Look at this. Look at this push that he's not defending this. He's physically not defending this. Mega Knight crushes this tower. <laughs> bro, this is a this is the mid ladder player's worst nightmare. And a freeze, bro. Arena 12, bro. I then opened the legendary chest from Trophy Road. Phoenix. Give me Phoenix. Give me Phoenix. I love the bud. Bro, I love the bud. Please. Okay, Mega Knight. Mega Knight, that's fine. Phoenix? A wild card. Bro, oh, okay, fine. Right. Phoenix! 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 Ah! Oh. We then spend another 100 pounds on gems. Okay, we received the gems. So as you can see, I have almost no gold. Only 6,000. Like, I can't upgrade anything. So you know what? Oh, this is... Oh, this is so not worth it, but I need it. I need this. We then bought more legendary king's chest. 69 three musketeers. Uh, barrel. Phoenix, Phoenix, Phoenix. Ow! Oh, oh, Phoenix! Let's go. And another daddy monk. Another daddy monk. Another daddy monk. Another daddy monk. I'm just going to fast forward these chests because nothing interesting happened until the end. Okay, let's upgrade. Let's unlock the ice wizard. I'm not going to use it. And another daddy monk. Wait, that means I can make my monk level 13. No way. We have a level 13 monk. And right after this, I made some trades in my clan. So I joined my clan and hopefully one of these lot accept this trade. Having a level 13 monk in Arena 12 was just unfair and we destroyed everyone. He puts my father, he puts a magic archer. He's so lucky I don't have monk on cycle. Okay, I'm gonna put, oh my, okay. Pack up here. Oof, we got a really big push coming up now. This might just be a three crown right here. Bad scar me. My witch is gonna shred that into pieces. Yep. GG. Boom! Balloon. We're gonna freeze his whole life. His father could do nothing against my Pekka. Freeze everything. I don't even think we have to, but let's just do it either way. We freeze the magic arch and ah! Arena 13. Just like that in like nine hours. That's insane. I then spent my final 100 pounds. So we have spent the final 100 pounds off the video. What do you mean connection lost? It did this last time as well. Wait, it's gonna give me my gems, right? 14,000 gems received. We have 16,000 gems. However, I didn't have much gold, so I had to spend so many gems upgrading cards. I need to, I need to spend gems to upgrade my Pekka, but it's fine. Uh, let's put a witch, wild card. Let's upgrade my uh, witch as well. 1,600 gems. And I then came to this conclusion. I must spend the rest of the 14,000 gems later on. I don't want to spend them yet. Pushing to Arena 14 was smoother than my cheeks, and we three crowned everyone. Pekka the back. Mega Knight at the back. This guy's an idiot. Oh, that's why. Phoenix, finish that thing, please. I Spirit to reset the... Perfect. Nikita is finished. Now we put a balloon. Log. My hardwood up the skeletons of the Mega Knight get shredded. And I think we might three crown here again. Hold on, I'm gonna freeze. This could be a three crown. This could be a potential three crown. I feel like he's gonna put something high. Come on. There we go. Nikita got finished in a minute. Arena 14, bro. I then bought another chest and created a brand new deck. Guys, check out my idea. We do Monk. We do Log. We do Elite Barbarians. We do three Musketeers. We do Heal Spirit. We do Phoenix. We do arrows, and let's do one good Electro Wizard. This deck was honestly good, and we pushed to Arena 15 insanely quick. Honestly, I'm not going to let that Hog Rider connect, so bang. Heal Spirit behind to heal everything, hopefully put something on top. With the Electro Wizard, my reconnect. Oh, but the E-Bobs get healed. The E-Bobs? Okay, okay. I'm going to skip half of the game, because nothing interesting happened until the end. Let's protect them. Perfect, we protect the three musketeers. No, that hog rider. The hog. The hog. The hog. The hog. Come on, three musketeers. Three musketeers. Stay alive. Stay alive. Stay alive. Stay with me. Stay with me. Stay with me. Stay with me. Come on. Three musketeers. Touch the tower. And boom, GG. Arena 15. Let's go. I then opened some chests, upgraded my cards, blah, blah, blah. And I then got prepared for my big final push. 
I'm going to pull off a madness and try to get 6,000 trophies. This was my first time ever pushing more than 5,000 trophies. But since our deck was so overpowered, we got to 5,500 with no problem. Well, three musketeers now. Hopefully, put a sparky. Put a sparky. Perfect. Perfect. Now we protect my three women. Oh my, this is perfect. Okay, I'm gonna just put it early just in case. Wait, wait. Oh! Oh! Oh no, but my three musketeers are in front now. What are you doing? You woman, you're meant to be protected by the men. Nah, no, it's fine. 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 Because now we're about to take that tower. We better take that tower because we just lost ours. Okay. And boom! Perfect. Let's go for three musketeers again. Put Sparky. Yes! Sparky reflect everything. Okay. Wait, watch out with the thing at the back. Come on. Come on. Come on. Monk, Monk, three musketeers are goaded. Okay. They connect. They connect. Arrows. Hopefully, I kill a scum if he does place one. Okay. You know what? Three musketeers in the pocket. Three musketeers in the pocket. He's too dumb. He's too dumb to expect this. He's too dumb to expect this. No. No. Yes. Ah, oh, let's go. We made it to Arena 16, Executioner's Kitchen. And then I finished spending all my money with this. I gold, here we go. Ah, here comes the gold, 75K gold. We needed that, we needed that. And I think that completes the 500 pounds that I was forced to spend. And then I spent all of my remaining gems on lots of chests. Oh, and we can get a different champion now. I just realized, I'm still gonna use Monk though. Uh, I'll just take Skeleton King though, just to unlock it. But when I started climbing the final trophies to 6,000, we had a problem. Freeze, and a, and a swarm. And he cries, bro, and he sends a crying emote. I can't with this game, I can't with this game, I can't with this game. I spent 500 pounds on this game, and people still managed to have more levels than me. Oh my, and it's got me, and it's got me, bro, and it's got me. This is literally never going to be finished. Mega unbelievable. Let's try for this one desperate push. Let's try. One desperate push. One desperate push. Wow. Wow, and he freezes. And I missed my freeze. I missed my freeze. Bro, I missed... <sighs> no way. <laughs> I can't win this game. Look at my battle log. Look at the people's decks, how over-leveled and hard counter it is. Look, loss, loss, victory, loss, victory, victory, loss, victory, loss, victory, loss, victory, loss, 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 loss. Basically, I was stuck at 5,800 trophies. Look, I was playing for 14 hours. I wasn't feeling well. This game was driving me crazy and I just couldn't win anymore. And you know what? Maybe this game isn't so pay to win after all. Predict. Rage. Wow. Level 13 Pekka. Okay, I give up. I give up right here. I can't be asked anymore. Thank you guys for watching. Comment down below, Mummy Pekka, if you made it this far. I'm not doing this no more. I'm leaving it here, man. I want to get some sleep. I, I can't, bro. My head hurts. I can't anymore. Peace out, guys.